I got a use for you. fuel. Drifter.
How you doing, kid? They won't let me leave. <laughs> Why would you want to leave? It's safe here. I have to work. Okay. Hey, man. <laughs> Need gas? Thanks, brother. Digging out. Face was scarred, so uh more please. What else can we do? Uh, where's it back? Uh, looks like a fire uh, No! Yeah! 
Sniper. You don't need these. Still got old iron tooth on you, yeah?
Someone's here. It's a drifter. Let him in. Can I help you? Low on fuel, huh? We're gonna run out of this someday, you know. Need to tune up. Yeah. You find that son of a bitch? Yeah, here's old Iron Tooth, just like you asked. Ah, uh, nice work. Deke, you're always the one person I could count on to get things done. <laughs> you know, I have no idea where you and Boozer rode off to, but it's good to see you. Well, we're around, Tuck, and if you need anything, you know how to reach me. Go see Alki. I'll update your credits. Wait a sec, I got it. Hold on, I never did finish burning out this nesting zone. Later, burn out these nests. Deacon St. John, you out there? 
Got a job for you here at the Hot Springs. Doctor, okay, I'll head your way. St. John out. Like he was, uh, Bye. like he was waiting for someone. Deke, don't let him get away. I want him alive. Uh, what the Ooh. shit? Tucker alive? More shit has come up missing. I need him to tell us where he stashed it. Okay, shit. All right, I'll see what I can do. Oh, come on, Roach. Where do you think you're going, huh? Still back here, you son of a bitch? Fine. All right, let's do this the hard way. No, no, I wish I could kill him, but I can't. Don't let him get away, Deke. Don't let him get away! To hell with you! How's it going? Hey. Roots, slow down! I just want to talk! Yeah? That why Tucker sent you? To talk? <laughs> Yeah, goddammit! If I wanted to kill you, you'd be dead! <sighs> Up your ass. I know what you've done to Leon and Alvarez. Don't let him get away, Deke. Roger, are you late for something? Where are you going? <sighs> the hell with you, St. John. Goddammit! Get him! What the hell? Shit! Hey! How's it going, buddy? See? Told you I wasn't gonna kill you. Well, uh, oh, Deke, no. No, oh, I, I didn't do nothing. Oh, oh. Nah, that's not what Tucker says. I guess when Leon and Alvarez took off with the camp's drugs, they forgot to cut you in. Is that about it? Oh, oh, Deke, no. No, no, no. Clue me in on what you're thinking, man. I, I want to understand. You you took what was left while the old woman wasn't looking? Oh, Deke. Uh, I got nothing on me, okay? Search me. Uh. <laughs> no, I'm not. It's not my job. I'm going to leave that up to Alki. Hey, Tuck. I got Deke. him. Mark down these uh, coordinates and have Alki sent Heard what you did to Leon, okay, Deke? I, 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 please, man. He's alive. Come on, please. Did he have my drugs? Deke, no. well, yeah, please, he's please, alive, we rode together, you remember? Stay that way, you and me, we were friends! Up and get off his ass. St. John out. Please, please. Oh, I hey, don't want to die. You there? Oh, don't leave yeah. me out here. Come on. Crazy oh, question. Timey. Any idea oh, where I damn you! Thundering. God damn you! What the hell for? The kid I brought in, just trying to find a way to cheer her up. She mentioned having one. Shit, I don't know. Check the dish on the bell that crater. Maybe they're in force. Yeah, okay. Thanks. Ah, 
Uh-oh, I should stop for fuel. Infestation zone later. Jesus, something went down. Wonder if the poor bastards had anything worth looking for. I got a use for you.
It's okay. Open the gate. Lisa, I... Go away. I brought you something. It's beautiful. Will you take me with you? Take me back to Marion Forks. Look, I, I can't because it's not safe. I gotta turn in. They make us get up really early for work. Can I help you? Hey, what's going on? Oh, I got some gas here. Whew. Stuff's getting scarce. <sighs> Need to tune up. Deacon? Okay. What are you looking you for? Need something? Need anything else? Can I get anything else for you? Good choice. Find me if you need anything else. Okay. You here for your bike? Hey, how's it going? Let me get the gate for you. What? Uh, Boozer said you guys were uh, thinking about heading north. Yeah, yeah. As soon as we put together enough gear, we're riding out of here. Tucker's starting to get on my nerves, you know? Oh, shit. We're gonna miss your stuff. You got a problem? St. John, you out there? We got a job for you here at Peaceful Lake. Go for it. Yeah, okay. Um, I'll head your way. St. John out.
Hey, uh, you're not answering the radio. Yep. I oh, know I was. Well, hold on, hold on. No, I'm all right. I'm all right. Just I'm trying to get clear. You know. You're burning up. Ugh, my head's pounding like a mother. You're burning up. No, no, no. I'm just, I'm just tired. Okay, stay here. Rest. I'll think of something. Look, I don't need a goddamn babysitter. I'm fine. Shit. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Think. Here, come here. I'll show you what you're looking for. Uh. Yep, found it. <laughs> All right, come on, focus. I am focused. All right, so this one is called Lavandula angustifolia. Lavender? Yes, well, I'm still paying off my student loans, so I will stick with Latin, mm -hmm. but you could call it that. Yeah, get your money's worth. Go for it. <laughs> okay, come on, give me your hand. <sighs> All right, so you want to put one hand around the flower. All right. And then put the other hand at the stem. Okay. Just like that, and then you pull nice and slow. You know, I pulled weeds before. Uh, excuse me, sir, this is not a weed. You have to be gentle. And but apply pressure. Oh, yeah, but not too hard. <laughs> okay, ready? Mm-hmm. Go. There you go, that's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> and it doesn't smell very good. Okay, you hold on to those and I'm gonna collect more. <laughs> so, uh, why lavender? Well, the guys at the lab are pretty excited. They, they think they have this subspecies, which might have mutated monoterpenoids, which produce a modified linalool that that is so, oh my, thank you, Einstein, thank you. <laughs> Sorry. It has a chemical that we can use to synthesize a new medicine for burn patients. Where I'm from, the only weed used for medicine is the kind that you smoke. You know, Boozer knows a guy with a farm It's about three miles up the road. Oh, that's great. Boozer's gonna wind up in prison and take you with him. <laughs> so what else do you guys make, like chemical weapons, WMDs, shit like that? No, 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 no. Well, at least not me. Yeah? It's in my contract. None of my research can be used for military purposes. Hey, there's more over here! Wait, stop. Oh, come on, the water's yeah. gonna be great! Hold, hold on, hold on. What's wrong? Well, I, I didn't mean stop that. <laughs> Come on, what is it? It's a long story. Well, that's okay. We can just walk. I like walking. <laughs> so, why don't you tell me about your plants? Really? Okay. Well, this particular genus is adventitious. You want me to ask? It means not native to this area. You can thank Ogden for that. Who? Oh, shit, I asked. Peter Skeen Ogden, first explorer to come through this part of Oregon. He and some of the other early explorers brought all their medicinal herbs and plants with them. Some got away, and now they're growing here. Mostly along the shores of small lakes and ponds. First white explorer. Wow, look at you. Being all politically correct. Don't buy into all the biker stereotypes you see on TV. We are actually quite charming. I bet. The MC's got a couple of brothers, one fully patched. I don't think I've seen one person of color since I arrived in your strange little backwater paradise. Yeah, Jack actually had some guys bust in from Sacramento just to piss off our skinhead rivals. He did not. <laughs> no, he did not. I'm kidding. Jersey Jim's an old buddy of mine. Patched him and myself. We served in the same unit. Come by the clubhouse Sunday. I'll show you around. You like the guy. He's funny as shit. He makes a mean margarita. Well, I have to be in the lab early on Monday, so... I'll have us back in your bed by 10. I promise. How can I refuse an offer like that? <sighs> okay, you try picking some now. Lavender. You, you want me to pick lavender? Yep. And bring me three plants and don't touch them. Oh, I'm gonna crush him. <laughs> Come on. Uh, got one. Good for you. This one? Yep, keep going. 
Last one. Great, bring him here. <sighs> oh. <laughs> For you. Wow, gallantry is alive and feral after all. No, if he is <laughs> not, then I didn't kill him. <laughs> hey, oh, oh, oh. Aww, poor guys. Hey, is that the one we're gonna smoke later? No, but this is the one we're gonna drink. I make this killer herbal tea with it. I'll bet. <laughs> <laughs> hey, all right, if you come over, then I will make it for you as long as you give me a ride home. All right, great. You're gonna be a believer. And we'll grab a beer from myself on the way over. <laughs> Let's see. That should do it. Should look for fuel. Needed this. Done. Uh, sorry, uh, a little out of it when you said something. It's, uh, it's something Sarah showed me a few summers ago before. Anyway, uh, there's a plant that grows out here called lavender. It grows in the shade, along rivers, lake shores. I'm gonna see if I can find some. Shit, brother. The way my arm's feeling, I'll try anything, but fuck the lavender, bring something I can smoke. Whatever. I'm gonna find some of this shit, I'm gonna make a burn sap out of it, and you're gonna shut the hell up about it. Yeah, okay. I'm sorry, brother. Just... Going stir crazy up here, you know. Uh, don't worry, Moose Man. We're riding north, I swear to God, not too much longer. You hear me? Yeah, out. Deke, you got your radio on? Had some time on my hands, made you some shit. Booze man? Thank you, brother. Uh, I'll be by.
go. That should be it. Too bad. Hey, Boozer. Uh, God damn it. Uh, it's a funny thing. I, I was remembering how. Uh, a few summers back, Sarah took me out to Bear Creek. We were picking lavender, and uh, she Listen. taught <laughs> she taught me how to make this sap for burns. And uh, look, I got out today. Okay, I actually had a look around the mountain. I cleared some traps. The arm's almost as good as new. All right. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it right here. Hey, hey just give me a couple days. Okay, just we'll ride up north like you said and get out of this shithole. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We got hit. And hard. Rippers. A couple of dozen, maybe more. Goddamn rippers. That little gal you were so worried about? Yeah, Lisa. Wait, hold on. What happened? Where's Lisa? Gone. They took her and three others. Alki followed them as far as he could. But they're holed up at Belknap Crater. He came back to round up more men, but... God damn it! Okay, look, I've seen what those sons of bitches do to hostages. I'm not waiting.
well as the girl. If you've hurt her, I swear to God. Who am I kidding? I'm gonna fucking kill you all whether you hurt her or not. Hang on, Lisa. I'm coming. What's this? Lisa's? Sure as hell don't belong to a goddamn river. Small footprints. Girl's size. It's gotta be Lisa. She was dragged through here. If you've hurt her, you sons of bitches, I'm gonna kill every last one of you. They won't be joining your goddamn cult. The last we have freed them. Okay, here we go. Yes. You are lost! Lost! I am lost! A shot! Not a lot of ammo left. We need this. Got 
it. Director up here. Lisa's got to get Coming, kid. Lisa. Lisa? Hey. Sweetheart. No! Hey! Hey! No! hey, hey. Shut up! Shut up! It's, it's me. It's Deacon. Remember? Deacon? Okay. All right. That's all right. It's all right. Come on. You okay? Damn it. Can you run? Do you know where the visitor center is? All right. That's where my bike is. I need you to run air as fast as you can. Don't stop. Don't stop. All right, don't stop no matter what. You ready? Huh? Go. Get down, 
Get down! I'm shot! David! Go, go! Get to my bike. Run. We're safe now. Are you okay? No. Listen to me. To the south of here, there's a camp at Lost Lake. It's nothing like the Hot Springs. Iron Mike, he's not like Mrs. Tucker. I hated Mrs. Tucker. <laughs> you, know, you wouldn't be alone there. This is a nice camp, and it's a safe place. Okay. Hold on. Ricky! Ricky, come back! Ricky, are you still on this channel? Lost Lake Camp, come in. Deacon? Ugh, long time no here. What do you want? Just... meet me, okay? On the Cascade Highway where it intersects with the old Belknap Road. I'm heading there now. You know what Iron Mike said? The night you and Booza rode out of here? Uh, oh yeah. That. Uh, listen! That's why I radioed you and not Schizo. Iron Mike doesn't even have to know about this. I got a kid here. What? Well, I mean, not a kid. Uh, a survivor. She's been out here a long time. A, a, you've got a survivor, and you're bringing her to Lost Lake. No, you're bringing her to Lost Lake. I'm bringing her to you. Ricky, you there? Yeah, okay. okay. I'm on my way. Lost Lake out. Ricky? Uh, yeah, okay, you're welcome. You're gonna like it there, kid. It's like I said, Iron Mike, he's, um, uh, he likes to yell a lot. Look, don't let him bother you. You got that? Uh, anyway, there's this guy named Schizo. If he bothers you at all, well, just tell Ricky. Or, uh, tell Addie. She's the camp's doctor. You tell her. And Addie's, she's good. She's got medicine, you know, to clean up those, uh, to clean... Hey, Ricky. Hey, Deke. I'm surprised. What, did Tucker give up the slave trade? Uh, Lisa, this is, uh, Ricky. She's going to, uh, take you to a safe place. Nothing has changed, Deke. Iron Mike is not going to pay you for this. Pay me for- oh, come on. That's not- excuse me. That's not what this is about. It's not about collecting a bounty or anything. You just, mm -hmm. you just take her. Huh? What's wrong with her, Deke? What's wrong with her? She was- had a run-in with some rippers. I had to- Oh, my God. Hey, Lisa. Hi, I'm Ricky. Listen, do you like to go fishing? I love fishing. It's it's my favorite thing in the whole wide world. Would you want to go fishing with me? 
Yeah? Come on, I'm gonna tell you about Lost Lake. It has the clearest water you have ever seen. And the fish, oh my God. The fish in the morning, they jump this high. I'll show you. When we go, we're gonna have such a good time. Make sure you hold on tight, okay? Ready? I really appreciate it. 